एवरीवन हेलो हाउ आर यू ऑल यू कैन राइट इन द चैट बॉक्स हाय एडन अक्षिता अब्दुल शुजैन और यू बहुत निशान विनाया डेविड हानिया कायरा सिमोन रियांशी हाय विंसी ग्रेट ग्रेट हाउ आर यू गाइस डूइंग Great David Rutash, great. Hi Daniel, Rutash, Simon. If what? Hi Shizan. Hi Yathrev, how are you all? Great, amazing. Guys, please, if possible, please turn your cameras on so that I can see your beautiful faces. I can see lots of similar faces there. I can see both the Abduls there. and i know yes and the and the my students know that i love to see the see faces of my students they're so beautiful and just it just make me so happy so if it's possible please turn your cameras on not problem david okay daniel not a problem hi ayat i'm doing good thank you everyone i am christine and today i will be having a session on non verbal reasoning So first of all let's see how many of you actually like non verbal reasoning just raise your hand quickly do you like non verbal reasoning okay i can see i can see all right all right so many hands are raised now okay eight of you use your uh, use the google meet reaction the to hand raise your hand okay 14 of you all right that's great amazing I can see so many of you like non-verbal reasoning. Okay, Sean, I get it. Great, Washni, Vincy, great, great, Charles, D P, great, perfect. Pratash, oh my God, perfect, great, amazing. That means we are going to have lots of fun today. You guys like non-verbal reasoning, right? Great, great, perfect. Now you can put your hands down. I know, I know it now. Great. So first of all, for the beginning, first thing first. Today we are Gilecta. We provide face-to-face, -face, offline as well as the online classes. We provide the one-to-one -one sessions as well as the group sessions. We cover the eleven plus, the GCSEs, GCSEs, the A levels. We cover all the boards as well. We cover all the boards as well, as you can see on the screen. CSSC style for eleven plus set GL FSC everything. That's a beautiful, that's beautiful one. Ada baita, that's great. You look beautiful. Great for a GCSE also. We'll follow different boards: AQA, Edexcel, OCR, Educast, and same for the A levels. Focusing on the eleven plus today. We key fee for first. Our key features are first of all we have the live sessions just like the one we are having. and all the sessions are exam oriented basically the target your exams the one that you have to clear for are you all i'm pretty sure most of you are actually joining this for your 11 plus preparations right and how is the preparation going on does anyone wants to tell me about it in the chat box how are the preparations going on for the 11 plus hi rutvik hi minakshi sajlok hayden jessica great ishan rakshita uzma hazik great great Oh my God! Everyone is preparing good. There are so many people because it's a live session, Akshita. It's a very, it's a fun, right? It's fun, don't you think so? Great, Riyanshi, Ayad, good job. You're not. I know Abdul. <laughs> I'm aware of you about you. Then Hayden, great, good job. I'm glad. I'm glad everyone is preparing and and working really hard. Good job. So. we actually provide the notes the practice tests and exams we provide the weekly assignments we provide the doubt sessions the counseling according to your needs okay abdul all right great the we also provide the past papers and the all the assignments that we also do we actually provide the questions based on the based on the format that would be there in your papers in this session we are going to do a one of the most important topics of non verbal reasoning which is nets and cubes so tell me is there any how many of you actually find it little difficult it's this one is little tricky right do you think so the nets and cubes this topic is little tricky i agree i agree completely agree yes when see i can see that correct correct 
completely agree with you this topic is little tricky right but today we are going to a pro never heard of it akshita all right that means you're going to learn about it today not a problem okay ishan can you would like to tell me about it in the chat box yes ashank i agree with you it's like medium difficulty this topic is not so easy i would say but you know what for the questions of nets and cubes for the questions of nets and cubes there is a particular approach that we have to follow when we are doing the questions if we follow the approach if we stick to the approach we will definitely get the correct answer no way we will get the incorrect answer if we stick to the approach we just have to follow the approach when we are doing the questions all right and what today we are going to discuss about it correct jessica correct this okay hidden so today we are going to learn about the approaches that we need to follow when we are practicing questions of nets and cubes now for the ones who are not aware about this topic or what topic is it what actually happens in this topic let's see nets and cubes is a uh, but before that i want all of you to be ready with your you know notebook and pen Hishank, you want to say something? If you want to ask something, you can ask in the chat box. If anyone wants to ask something, you can always be active in the chat box. Then we will be practicing questions also. If you know the answer, you can always go to the chat box and write your answer. We will see if you get me the if you give me the correct answer before me. Let's see who gets the answer first. Correct, okay? But of course, first thing first, we will discuss the approaches. You want to say something, Mahin? You can write you write what you want to say in the chat box here. You are not allowed to unmute yourself. Whatever you want to say, you can always tell me or ask me in the chat box. This is for all of you. If you want to say something, go for the chat box. I am act currently looking at it only. Be ready with your notebooks. Pay attention to all the details that I'm going to explain. Pay attention to the approach that I'm going to tell you. And make sure your camera, mic, and chat box, everything is enabled. I want you guys, if you possible, just keep your camera on. We or uh, Zelecta are I actually present on different platforms, which is GC, YouTube, the Zelect, Instagram, the WhatsApp, Facebook, and Telegram. You can join us on different platforms as well. The topic, which is cubes and nets, I'm pretty sure you guys know about the cubes, right? Cubes, a three D shape. Cube is a three D shape. It's like let's say you have a box, a cube box, a cardboard box. Many a times we have tried to cut it and open it, right? To make it flat. Have you ever tried it? Let's see how many of you tried it. You can write in the chat box yes or no. We actually try to cut the box open and make it flat. Make it flat. Yes, I can see many of you have tried it. Great job. So cube is the three D shape. Okay, okay. Some of you have not tried it. All right. Let's. You can try it after this session now. You have a cardboard box. Cut it and open it and make it flat. But always cut it from the corners only. Okay, only from the corners. When you open it, you have a net-like structure which is a two D shape. Can you see it? Which is a two D shape. If you open the net, which is a three D shape, you will. If you open a cube, you will get a two D shape, which is a net. Now, questions in the cubes and nets is mostly about how they'll give you a net. they will ask you like which type which of the cubes can be made from that net right there are mostly mostly three types of questions from it they will give you a net an open 2d shape they will ask you what cube can be made if you fold it what cube can be made using that net another type of question maybe they'll give you a net they'll ask you which type of cube cannot be made out of the five options four nets can be made only one of them cannot be made and type 3 is they'll give you a uh, four or three perspectives of the cube they'll ask you about the net they will give you the cube they will ask you the net we will try some of the types of today only perfect thanks ishan i'll go through it so let's say there can be different types of cubes nets there can be various types of cube nets as you can see how many types of cube nets are there on the screen in the chat box do not raise your hands in the chat box no devesh can't properly and none of you are allowed to annotate okay okay yes you're sending me correct there are total 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 total 11 types of cube nets can be are possible if you fold these nets you will make you will make a cube okay one thing that is that i want all of you to understand is 
many a times if i have a cube if i have a cube do you think the opposite faces can ever be come can ever come side by side if you rotate the cube if you rotate the cube can the opposite faces ever come side by side let's say if you have a box let's say if can you see the box can you see the box let's say if you have a box if you rotate it no matter how i rotate it the opposite faces always be opposite right no matter how i rotate it yes or no that so this is a trick that we need to understand and this is something that we should we keep in mind when we are doing the questions based on cubes and nets so how do i know if i fold the cube net which faces will be opposite so pay attention first of all any three faces in a cube net any three faces in a cube net just make pick any row let's say this one 1 2 3 the extreme ones will always be opposite in a th combination of 3 in a row extreme ones first and third one will always be opposite if i fold this cube net if i fold this cube net the first give me a second the first and the third one will always be opposite let's say this is 2 this is 4 this is 5 and 6 i'm doing the first one i would want you guys to try for the rest pay attention this is important if you understand this bit you will easily do the other questions so i said if i make this group a three in a row the first and the third one will be opposite yes or no the first and the third one would be opposite now for the other ones if i say this is a group of three 2 4 5 5 the extreme ones would be opposite 2 and 5 would be opposite can i say that 2 and 5 would be opposite If, if if there is anyone who is not understanding it you can always write in the chat box i will repeat it for you not a problem but you have to tell me if you understand it or not just make sure you are active in the chat box so that i know if you are if you are understanding it or not the make a group of 3 the extreme ones are opposite 2 and 4 let me say it say it again make a group of 3 for example if i say these 3 2 4 5 so second and the fifth the extreme ones not the middle one extreme ones would be opposite to each other if you fold the cube then make a then make a group of 4 5 and 6 then make a group of 4 5 and 6 i'm saying it again please pay attention please pay attention so if i say a group of 3 again 4 5 6 4 and 6 would be opposite yes i you are correct good job 4 and 6 would be opposite or does it make sense just make a group of 3 extreme ones would be opposite let's try the same thing in the second cube net are you guys ready let's try the same thing in the second cube net let me give the numbering let's say this is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 now what is the first thing how do you know which ones are opposite just make a group of 3 1 4 5 and five. in a row they has to be in a row or in a column just in a straight line 1 4 5 which ones would be opposite now tell me in the chat box quickly in a group of 1 4 5 which ones would be opposite very good riyanshi correct 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 hania correct rakshita correct ishan very good very good so the first correct vincy first and fifth one would be opposite correct shazan correct shuzoy correct kaira basically group of 3 the extreme ones would be opposite correct abdul very good correct navya perfect so the first and fifth one would be opposite now you are done make another group akshita are you understanding it all right perfect correct vincy good job correct sashank correct ayushman very good make another group then which ones are opposite now very good you are three very good you so joy perfect david and aisha akshita all of you are correct good job four and six would be opposite amazing and if i talk about so of course one is opposite to 5 4 is opposite to 6 so the remaining ones 2 and 3 would be opposite to each other easy the remaining one would be opposite to each other 2 and 3 perfect devesh nusha shashank all of you great job amazing very good amazing let's try for the next one now i would want all of you to be active in the chat box so that i can see how many of you are understanding it yes vincy very very easy <laughs> great 
फाइव एंड सिक्स सो वट डू वी हैव टू डू विच वन सर अपोजिट नाउ मेक यूर ग्रुप्स इन योर माइंड करेक्ट आयुष्मान इजी आई डोंट गेट इट इट्स ओके शफाई लेट मी सेल यू अगेन वट वी हैव टू डू आई गिव द नंबरिंग जस्ट मेक अ ग्रुप ऑफ थ्री थ्री फेसेज थ्री नंबर्स इन अ रो लेट्स से यू डिसाइडेड टू मेक द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ ग्रुप ऑफ दीज थ्री वन थ्री एंड फाइव वन थ्री एंड फोर नाउ एक्सट्रीम वन एक्सेप्ट फॉर द मिडल वन द अदर टू वुड बी अपोजिट Except for the middle one, the other two would be opposite. Very good, Rianchi. Correct. Very good, Vinci. Good job. Correct. So joy, amazing. You guys are doing great. So the first and the fourth, these two would be opposite. First and fourth. Do we get it, Shafai? First and fourth. This one would be opposite. Three in a row or in a column. Three in a line. Extreme ones, not the middle one. Extreme ones would be opposite. Now make the other group. That was one, four, and five. I think. No, one, three, and four. Give me a second. So if I say these three and five now would be opposite because in a row. Three and five would be opposite, and then the remaining ones, two and six, would be opposite. Perfect, Vinaya. Correct, Rakshita. Good job. I hope this is clear to all of you. Aradhna is saying very, 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 and so many easy. <laughs> Great! I am glad you found found it easy, Aradhna. Good job. Now the question would be now for easy lemon squeezy. Okay, Ayushman. Yes, someone raised a hand. Ah, uh, you can ask in the chat box, dear, if you have a question. Very easy. All right. Hi, Navya. Okay, perfect. Now your homework would be. I am labeling these parts one, two, three. Your homework would be you will tell me the opposites in each case. Okay, I am labeling the parts one, two, three, four. In each case, you will send me the pictures. You have the WhatsApp number. Numbers are there below. You can go for the numbers. You will tell me the opposite faces in each case. Okay, you will tell me the opposite faces in each case. Let me just write the numbers. Then you can take the screenshot. And it's Samsung SMT two two zero. If you want to say something to you, please ask in the chat box. I'm writing the numbers. Your homework would be to send me the opposite faces in each of the cases. Just the last bit now. Ishan is sending me the screenshot also. He's like, okay, Ishan. All right. Now you guys can take a screenshot for the remaining faces. You will tell me. You will send me the opposite faces for all the cubes. Nets. Everyone, take a screenshot and send and type done in the chat box if you have taken the screenshot. Type done in the chat box if you have taken the screenshot. Correct. Jessica is done. Done. All right. All right. Okay. Still, so many are left. Go for it. Perfect. Perfect. I still have not received everyone's done. All right. Amazing, great, <laughs> and someone is like done. They're like done. Yes, Miss, we are done. Shall we move on then? This will be easy. Yes, Ayushman, it would be easy. Trust me. Perfect. All right, Ayushman. Now see the cubes nets can be folded in any way to make the cube. Right? Different nets can always will always make up. Or always fold to make a different cube. Now let's try some questions. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Perfect. I will be doing the first question. You will try the other questions. Whenever you are approaching the questions, the best way to do the cubes and nets question is the elimination method. What do I mean by elimination method? That means that you look for the options that are definitely not the answer. Yes, Navya is telling me. I know, I know. <laughs> that's great, Navya. I know you know. That's great. I've told, I've taught taught you this in the classes, right? So you know. <laughs> All right. Okay. Good. So the elimination method is that means you will look for the answers or you look for the options that would definitely will not be your answer. You eliminate those options and whatever you are left with that might be your answer. Make sense? Okay, Ayushman. That make does it make sense? Great. So let's try the first question. For example, this is my cube net. I will try to see if I fold this cube, which of the given cubes can if I fold this cube net, which of the cubes can be made? So look for the option A. It says 
there is a white circle or this rectangle black rectangle and a black circle is there a black circle in your cube net is there a black circle on your cube net no there is not so because of this fern it is not the answer and more many of you have sent me the answers in the chat box as well and almost all of you are correct good job for the second part you look carefully it says there is this bit do you think this rectangle is going parallel to this side of the hexagon do you think so the face where this hexagon is parallel to the side of rectangle however in option b it is not parallel can you see it it is touching it is perpendicular to it because of that it's not b c mm, i cannot eliminate it looks like a possible answer so you will leave it move on to the last one option d there are two hexagons are there two hexagons in your cube net are there two hexagons in your cube net no that means it's definitely not d so we are left with option c and that is our answer easy easy peasy lemon squeezy that's all what you want to say right <laughs> all of you want to say that only see i read your mind but great perfect yes all of you most of you got it correct good job correct very good abdul that's also a good point abdul said that if you we discuss the opposites see a group of three faces these three extreme ones that means this face and this face these two are opposite however in option b they has been shown side by side opposite faces can never come side by side right so that is why also we can eliminate the option b good point abdul so which is great am i testing your past memory how do you know that aishman maybe yes <laughs> yes now we are very good opposite ones can't be together if you want to say something uh, please write in the chat box let's say samsung smt220 all right let's try the next question let's see how many of you can actually get this one correct make sure you take care of the opposites opposite can never come side by side you also take care that if i say this rectangle is going perpendicular to the triangle in your options also or in your answer also there sh it should be perpendicular only so direction or position of the shape is also equally important okay i have started to receive lots of answer all right all right correct i think i am receiving correct answers good job devesh thakur hania david varshini rotash ayat no ayat is not correct dear no jeremy anisha is correct good job very good correct anisha amazing correct daniel good job very good go for it guys send me your answers try it out correct hasi correct correct adav Ad correct ganesh correct vins anaya great great aishman that's correct good job correct ishan very good very good correct navya good job okay there can be four or five options there can be either four or either five options depending on the different questions okay correct very good good job so let's discuss this one first of all again what is the approach to do the question the approach is elimination method we always follow the approach we never get the answer incorrect right so be careful now it says be careful we look for the position also like let's, let's take the option a in option a the rectangle and the circle and a square do you think if i take this group let me just highlight it for you let me take the highlighter and highlight it for you there is this the, i am taking these three faces now if i take three faces in a line the extreme ones would be opposite yes or no extreme ones would be opposite that means the circle and the black rectangle are opposite to each other that means they can never be side by side but in option a they are side by side they are opposite not possible so you eliminate option a very good and no one sent me the option a as an answer so great job guys very good then for option b i can see now take these three three in a line extreme ones this one the first one and the third one extreme ones never up, come together never can come side by side right these are also opposite but here they are shown opposites together again option b is not possible c looks like a possible answer there is a plus sign a circle and square looks like possible we'll move on 
ऑप्शन डी आई कैन सी द ब्लैक सर्कल द ब्लैक सर्कल द व्हाइट ट्रायंगल एंड द प्लस साइन वट इज द प्रॉब्लम देयर करेक्ट हानिया गुड जॉब वट इज द प्रॉब्लम देयर इन ऑप्शन डी लेट्स यू कैन टेल मी इन द चैट बॉक्स इन द चैट बॉक्स आई कैंट अलाउ यू टू अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ यू कैन ऑलवेज टेल मी इन द चैट बॉक्स करेक्ट वेरी गुड वेरी गुड Correct. Oh my God! Great. You guys are performing really well. Good job. Yes. In option D, if you see in our question, there is no black circle. There is a white circle. But in option D, they have given us a black circle. This should not be black, right? It should be white. That's why it's not D, and our answer is C. Perfect. Good job. Do we understand it? Quickly show me a thumbs up if we understand it in the chat box. Perfect. Great. Next, try this question out. Send me your answers in the chat box quickly. Perfect, perfect. Send me your answers in the chat box for this one quickly. Try this question out. Let's see you get the opposites. Be careful of the positions of the shapes. Mahin is black for me. What you have sent? Okay, okay. I am receiving different answers. Simon is correct by far. All right. Not all of you are correct. Advaita, Navya, correct. Devesh, correct. Aishman is correct. Tanya is correct. The others, please try to recheck your answers. It's not correct. Correct, Yatrib. Good job. Correct, Sujoy. Correct, Abdul. Very good. Very good. Correct, Rutash. Perfect. Good job. You're doing great. Correct, Nusha. The ones I'm not calling out the name for. Please recheck your answers. Ishan is correct. Very good, amazing. Correct, Ganesh. Correct, Thakur. Correct, Shashank. Correct, Vince. Very good, amazing. Correct, Kaira. Correct, Radna and Aisha. Ayat, amazing. Very good. Good job. Most of you send me the correct answers. Now let's discuss this question quickly. Correct, Konakshi. Good job. Now let's discuss this this question. As I said, correct, Jessica. Correct, Adav. We have to take care of the positioning as well. Now see if you see this rainbow thing. Can I call this rainbow? Who likes rainbow? Everyone does, right? No, Ishan saying no. He doesn't like rainbow. <laughs> you hate rainbow, Ishan? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. There are so many no's. Why do you hate rainbows? Because it's girly. You think? <laughs> What's that, Abdul? Okay. 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 That's what I thought. All right, okay. All right, Shazan. So let's see. But still beautiful. See, let's say there is a rainbow. I'm saying it. If you like it or not, you can call it an arc as well. This arc or this rainbow is actually pointing towards the star. Can I say that? And it is at the side of this black rectangle. The long side of the black rectangle is towards the rainbow. In option A, this is the short side of the black rectangle. Yes or no? so definitely not my answer b take care of the positioning the rainbow is pointing towards the star that's correct but the positioning of the rectangle is not correct if i look in option b there is a again it is pointing at the correct side great this one looks like a possible answer the at the side of the rainbow there is a white square looks like a possible answer let's move on to option c in option c if you be careful what is happening they have shown you the star the hexagon and the black and the black triangle again now what is the problem in that who can tell me who is going to tell me that what is the problem in option c let's see in the chat box in the chat box you can always write in the chat box all right okay i'm getting some answers okay yes very good the star is positioned the wrong way the star will not be positioned like that so it's why the rectangle at the wrong side correct it should be at the other side very good the rectangle it is at this side it should be the white square not the rectangle the direct the position of the rectangle is not correct very good how it is not option d why not option d as you can clearly see again is it if you want to say something to you please write in the chat box as you can see again three in a three in a line what is happening the extreme ones are the opposite that means the star and the circle are opposite right the star and the circle are opposite that means they can't be together 
However, in option D, they have shown together. So it's not option B. So the answer is option B. Perfect. If we understand it, just quickly show me a thumbs up. Quickly show me a thumbs up if you understand it. Perfect. Akshita, do I have your attention? Yes, I do. Great. Perfect. Amazing. All right. Let's try one more question of this type. Send me your answers in the chat box. Ruhi, if you want to say something dear, please write your write in the chat box. Let's try this question out quickly, guys. Send me your answers in the chat box. Okay, okay. I'm receiving some answers. All right, all right, okay. 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 Let me tell you this this shape here is shaded. Let me tell you this shape is, here is shaded if it's not visible to you guys. The shape here is shaded. So be careful when you are sending me your answers. Okay. All right. Correct Ayan. Correct Ganesh. Correct Ayushman. Very good. Correct Ratash. So joy. Amazing. I'm receiving so many correct answers. Kaira correct. Ayat Abdul Konakshi. Ab Okay, Vincy, correct. Gar Devesh, Ruhi, oh my God, perfect, amazing. You Most of you are sending me the correct answers, great. Amazing. Vinaya, Jessica, all of you are correct. Shafai, I don't understand this reaction though. What does that mean? Correct, Ayan, amazing. No, Rakshita, dear, take it. Correct. Shan, correct, very good, correct, Yatrip, amazing, amazing, very good. Anaya, correct, good job. <laughs> okay, Aradhana, perfect. All right, let's discuss this question again. We take care of the positioning here. It says, All right, it's not because a first it is shaded, the star thing is shaded, and also this that's why it is not possible. If I look for the option B, it is not B because these two things that are double, right? However, in your net, is the two types, it is only one time, right? The shape is only once, so it's not B because it is doubled in the cube. Why it's not option C again? Because this arrow is pointing towards this shape. And you guys know that three in a row extremes are opposite. So this bit and this bit are opposite. That's why they can't be side by side. But here in option C, they have shown side by side, right? So opposites can't be together. So it's not option C. That's why the answer is option D. The arrow is also pointing the correct way. The black oval shape is also the correct way. Good job. Perfect. Amazing. Now, I want to give some questions to you guys as homework as well. Can you guys take a screenshot for some of the homework questions that I want to give you? You can try these questions out as a homework. Please take a screenshot. This is your homework question one. I'll give some homework questions. Now, where you can write in the chat box, dear. Please take a screenshot. Show, just tell me done, done, done in the chat box once you are done with it. You can take a screenshot, try these questions out as a homework. Hania, if you want to say something, okay, uh, you are like showing me a thumbs up, okay? All right, all right. Most of you are done. Great job. Perfect, perfect. Okay, great. If you can't take a screenshot, it's okay. You can take a picture as well using a, some other device, maybe some other phone or anything. You can take picture as well. If not, screenshot. Perfect. Now, one more thing that I want you guys to tell that, of course, we are launching a half term course for all the 11 plus students. If you are preparing for 11 plus, we will be covering the advanced maths, the English, nonverbal reasoning, verb, verbal reasoning, creative writing. And we provide the 10% off for the 10% off to all the early birds, right? For the basically the first 10 students get a 10% off on all the courses that is being that are being provided. All right. Great. And we provide, as I told you, what are the key features of us? Make sure you join and again. Okay. Okay, Shafoy, this is the slide here. You can take a screenshot. You can join the different uh, platforms. You can join us on different platforms, Instagram, YouTube, uh, Telegram, WhatsApp, and all, all of these places, Facebook. All right. Okay, Charlize, but how do I know? Okay. No, there are more homework questions. Okay. This is your second homework question. Please take a screenshot. Second homework question. Take a screenshot, guys. 
परफेक्ट प्लीज टेक स्क्रीनशॉट करेक्ट करेक्ट देर वुड बी सून अब्दुल नॉट येट बट देर वुड बी सून ऑल राइट करेक्ट मोस्ट ऑफ यूर डन ग्रेट जॉब आई एम चेनिंग द स्लाइड नाउ परफेक्ट एंड द होमवर्क क्वेश्चन थ्री प्लीज टेक स्क्रीनशॉट फॉर दिस एज वेल ऑल राइट जैसे आई कैन सी दैट ग्रेट Correct, Daniel. All right, great, great, Abdul. Perfect. Please take a screenshot. Just show, tell me done in the chat box once you are done. Quickly, amazing, amazing, perfect. Great, Shakoi. Great job, Nusha. Correct, Devish. Very good, very good, perfect. Now I tell you to tell you something. You know about all the sessions that we have. We have one GCSE live session as well. So if there is someone, maybe you have a, you have an elder sibling or a cousin or anyone. who are covering the gcses so today we have a gcse combined science session as well and on 10th of february we have 11 plus session for the english and gcse chemistry so you make sure you join the next saturday class on the same time at 1 pm we will be covering the english of course i won't be there i'm not an english teacher but there would be an um, absolutely amazing english teacher that would be covering subject verb and agreement make sure you join it do not miss the session okay perfect now are you guys ready for a riddle show me a thumbs up quickly all right charles you can share this with her after this we have a gcse sessions also just after the session 2 pm she can join that and of course on every saturday as well are you guys ready for this riddle perfect i can see all of you are what is yours but mostly used by the others tell me in the chat box what is yours but mostly used by the others oh my god you know this you guys are smart <laughs> correct all of you i am getting all the correct answers not brain not how to how is your brain used by others you use your brain yourself no knowledge is yours you use it yourself yes i am getting many correct answers great great did have you guys heard of this before was it that easy <laughs> it is like yes of course i have heard of it no i How does your pencil used by others more? That's your pencil. You use it. No, that's not brain. It's not brain. That's okay. It's your name. Name is yours, but is it used by others? For example, Navya. Navya is name of Navya only, but I use it more than her, right? Her mother, her friends, her parents, her teachers, everyone around us more use more Navya word than Navya herself, right? Great. Now let's try another one. Are you ready? another one <laughs> yes abdul the answer is abdul yes your name basically not names but your name your name is yours but used by others all right try one more i am tall when i am young i am short when i am old what am i oh oh my god i am getting so <laughs> have you guys heard of these riddles before it's this these ones should not be these easy Okay, okay. Not human. How does human are tall when they are young? A two-year-old human and a fifteen-year-old human. The fifteen one are the taller one, no? Umbrella? No, it's not umbrella. No, no. Okay, pencil can be a correct answer. Correct, Ayat. Correct. That was not. But that was not my answer. But looks like a possible answer. Not a human. It's not a human. A two-year-old human is not young, taller than the fifteen-year-old human. No. Okay. Okay. How it? How is it? Piggy. No, it's not piggy. <laughs> okay, it's not piggy. All right. Okay. Okay. Perfect. It's a candle. If it's a new candle, it's tall. And when it continues to burn and burn and burn, and the older it gets, the shorter it will be. Right. The younger one is taller. It was a good one, right? And most of you got it correct. And some of you give me a new answer as well, which was great. That is a pencil. So amazing! Pencil is also a younger one. It's not Christine Navia. <laughs> okay, eraser. All right. I'm glad so far you're enjoying it. Great, great. Now let's try another type of questions in cubes and nets. Are you guys ready? another type of questions in cubes and nets so basically how do we approach these questions pay attention you're going to do this again on saturday i'm glad safa you should all of you should join on the saturday as well it's going to be very really really important 
now another type of question is they have given you the cube they will ask you the net given you the cube ask you the net be careful two things that you again we will follow the elimination method only two things that you will take care of the first the they are side by side so be careful that in the net they have not shown these faces in the opposite positions okay in the opposite position for example if you look at option b these lines and this triangle would be opposite according to this net yes or no however in our cube these are not opposite these but side by side so option b is not possible then what they have shown you this base of the triangle is towards the rectangle however in option a the base of the triangle is towards the circle again option a is not possible option c base of the triangle towards the square lines on the side looks like a possible answer but we only finalize our answer once we have eliminated all the other options check for the d again they have shown these two opposites but opposites can't be together right in our cube these two are together so according to option d these two are opposite which is not possible so you eliminate option d and your final answer would be c perfect most of you good good give gave me the correct answer which is great perfect amazing so that's how you always approach these questions does anyone has any doubt if you have any doubt feel free to ask in the class in the chat box all right okay perfect i'm glad you don't have any doubt great tell me if you have understood it or not yes or no in the chat box yes or no if you are if you have understand it yes if not it's a no go for it great great amazing <laughs> and someone has said yes that's so long yes that means you have understood it which is great all right let's try one more question perfect vincy great correct rakshita great ram correct riyanshi good job all right let's try one more question the approach remains the same elimination method elimination method be careful that none of the faces has placed in the opposite positions and the direction of the faces that the direction of the shapes the position of the shapes tell me your answers in the chat box quickly for this one in the chat box tell me your answers in the chat box quickly for this one what would be the answer for this one let's see how many of you get it okay all right i'm getting some answers okay but okay i'm different two different answers there's only one answer of course so be careful when you're sending me your answers check your answers again who have sent me their answers i'm not say, i'm a b c d i'm getting all the options from you guys be careful of your answers be careful none of the shapes should be placed opposite if i look at option a three inner line three inner nine the extreme ones are opposite that means this one and this one these two are opposite that means they can't be placed together but in our cube they are placed together right these are not opposite according to the given cube so option a cannot be our answer be careful of it option a cannot be our answer okay it's not no navya you can't be smart like that that's not acceptable <laughs> give me one give me one answer correct konakshi correct ayan correct thakur correct very good to abdul what's that correct correct hanaya correct ganesh correct suzoy very good samson and easy if you want to say something dear you have to tell in the right in the chat box you're not allowed to unmute yourself all right all right okay we can see correct correct mokshu correct the first one is correct mokshu you can't send all the answers though all right let's see option b there is no opposites the arrow is pointing towards this you know the four circle things looks like a possible answer let's move on to c first thing quickly eliminate the ones which are quickly eliminate the ones no they are not on the screen all right no they are not on the screen okay quickly eliminate the options which are opposite i can see three in a line three in a line the, the these ones are opposite this one and this one that means that's definitely not my answer not c now if it's either b or d because that's not opposite in those cases so whether it would be b whether it would be d you have to decide that what do you guys think whether it has to be b or d b or d what do you guys think 
if i if you see the arrow is on the right side of the circle thing so arrow is on the right side of the circle thing but 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 pay it be careful if you be careful the this arrow is parallel to this side of the triangle the side of the triangle is closer to the arrow however this side of the triangle is not closer to the arrow in this case right it is away however this side is closer to the triangle at this side are you getting my point yes or no the side of the triangle is closer to the arrow does it make sense so the answer is option b and not d this side is very far away from the triangle from the arrow yes no it's not different it's the like that only the right angle triangle <laughs> okay ayushman all right so the answer is b not d let me tell you again basically what happening is let me tell you again not a problem if you be careful let me zoom it for you guys give me a second if you see carefully this arrow is somewhat closer to the side of the triangle can i say that arrow is closer to the side of the triangle how in option b the side of the triangle is actually closer to the triangle arrow only of course we are friends navya what about can we can be we are friends are we not friends already however in this triangle if you say this triangle is and this side of the triangle they are far away right they are far away that's why it's not option d anya it's it's maybe something of the printing not just the shading is it just has to be shaded and non shaded not the dark on the light no navya it's not just you both of us are friends <laughs> i hope it is clear to you guys now option b is the correct one let's try this question out now be careful of the positioning the opposite ones can't be together the positioning is also positioning and the direction also matters be careful of this question send me your answers in the chat box correct priyanchi good job no correct abdul no 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 others are not correct no be careful be careful take care of the positioning correct daniel correct ayan <laughs> okay correct thakur correct shyam correct rutash ganesh okay ayan is correct we have sent it already hania correct aishwan correct navya correct others please cross check your answers again kaira correct rakshita correct good job good job amazing perfect ishan correct amazing others send me your answers ayat correct mokshu jessica all of you very good very good when i have not received your answer dear correct adav correct aradhana very good correct anisha good job perfect let's see now correct ruhi correct correct dp let's see the question let's discuss the question quickly how is it placed the positioning do you think this arrow is pretty is just at the side of this triangle thing here yes or no just at the side of it this this face this corner hair this corner hair is common to the arrow and this temple however this is going away the common edge the arrow is not closer to it so it's not option a it can be option b looks like a possible answer but 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 if i look if i pay attention the heart at the bottom of heart we have this arrow thing here we do not have it at the bottom we have it at the top of the heart right again not possible option c looks like a possible answer but 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 again in a line three in a line the extreme ones are opposite yes or no three in a line extreme extreme ones are opposite so again these two are opposite which is not possible so it's not option c and that's why the answer is option d it justifies it as well the this closure one the arrow is closure to the shape at the bottom of heart we have this arrow thing justifies all the conditions so the answer is option d now are you ready to some of the questions as homework i think i gave you three questions in the homework yet right so that's your homework question 4 take a screenshot tell me done in the chat box once you are done what happened charlies everything okay all right all right great take screenshots let me know when you are done perfect okay most of you are done you can if you are not able to take the screenshot you can take picture as well that's not a problem
perfect perfect what about that abdul what are those what do you think correct okay great that's okay we are learning that's okay we are here to learn right that's completely fine first we make the mistakes then we got the answer correct that's making mistakes is the first step to get the answer correct so that's not a problem all right the next question now over question five quickly take a screenshot guys tell me when when you're done okay okay it was correct easy great job take a screenshot quickly perfect okay and the next question homework question six homework question six great okay honey i'm waiting let me know when you're done all right most of you are done you can as i said if you are not able to take the screenshot you can take a picture as well okay advaita i understood you i understand you're done <laughs> but i can't see advaita where is she let me see where is she where is she advaita where are you raise your hand yeah there are you okay great i can see you yeshnu so i can see you great and the homework question seven then do not leave i have one more riddle for you guys let's see who can answer this one and i hope and pray this one is not so easy for you guys and i hope and pray you can move you okay perfect great great all right done perfect perfect okay <laughs> okay so i will see but i still i still hope that you guys don't get it that's what i wish so that i can win at least one riddle but of course i know you guys want to get that correct let me see let me get it give me a second we will win devesh is saying we will win miss or you are going to lose you got skills in riddle rutash okay that's great <laughs> all right we will win ayal is also saying you are way okay you losing i am losing okay not a problem but if you are winning i won't mind losing that's not a problem with me trust me okay the riddle is what kind of room has no doors or windows <laughs> okay ayan okay garage garage has it's looks like it has the door right you have of course it has a shutter you can do it okay i'm getting the correct answers ayan punita and so many others like ratash so many others have sent me the answers it's not a room aradhna okay it's not a garage it's not a boat boat is not a room no no i'm getting some correct answers though book book box box is not a room though <laughs> okay okay makes sense abdul living room has room of course you enter in the living room why in why some room only right okay let me see let me see sheep how come sheep has room no it's not sheep <laughs> it's a mushroom it's a mushroom and most of you got the answer correct which is great which is great perfect perfect amazing i'm glad you liked it yes aishman you want to say something dear you can tell me in the chat box quickly and why are you angry shafai what did i do <laughs> okay all right all right how mushroom because it's a mushroom how come is sheep you can tell me in the chat box Ruthvik I can't see you where are you you have to raise your hand All right great okay Shafai you are confused now All right okay I can see you Ruthvik perfect Now one more thing I'm sharing a link with you guys in the chat box that link is for a mock test you guys can try that mock test out you guys can copy the link 
open the link and you will receive a mock test you can try that out if you want to share your homework the numbers are at the bottom of the screen the different the website is there on the bottom of the screen okay shan is asking a riddle which animal wants to leave that's the riddle shan which animal wants to leave i'm not sure fly some of okay <laughs> okay i sure that's what i asked which room has it that's mushroom okay all right i hope all of you have got the riddle please call, got the link sorry copy it save it and that's it for this session if any one of you have any questions feel free to ask in the chat box and what's so delicate okay silence that silence i on i know this one all right that's it from my end guys okay you didn't get the link let me share it again give me a second you can get copy the link save it and if you open the link you will see a mock test i asked you 8 month ago what's that abdul you can try it if you want you can devish do not forget to join the session on the next saturday at the same time on the same link you will be having a session for english you and that is again yeah i know that ayan that's a promise okay all right all right perfect so that's it for this session guys i'll see you guys in the next one bye bye take care i don't know yaan what has to be broken before you use it okay you're asking me so many readers now it's going up and up and up and up because so many are there bye bye guys bye bye take care have fun bye 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 yes shafai you want to say something dear i couldn't uh, get your text if you're if you're saying something because there are so many just going up and up and up bye 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 yatri bye dikshita bye hania bye bye yes shafai write in the chat box please bye bye everyone bye take care what has five fingers but doesn't live oh what is it um i don't know what is it i'm not sure a glove that's true <laughs> that was a good one great Abdul, I will look for it definitely, and then I'll discuss about it in the next one. We all we have other sessions as well upcoming, right? Don't worry about it. All right then, guys. Bye bye. Take care. See you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. You guys can leave now. Bye bye. Thank you, Shafai. I'm glad. Thank you for the compliment. Bye bye, guys. Bye bye. Okay, easy. I'm waiting. But wait for what? Bye 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 bye. All right. What age is this? What do I mean by that? Is that a riddle? Easy. No. What age is this? Like eleven plus? Are you asking? Okay, eleven plus is you give an exam at the end of year five. Okay. All right. Now there would be another session. I'll see you guys next time. No easy. It's not for year. You are in year four. That's okay. You can start preparing. The earlier you start preparing, the better it would be for you, and you that better the easier it will be for you. That's not a problem. Okay. All right. Bye bye. Take care. Bye bye Samsung I'm not sure what's your name but bye bye take care bye Zonara bye Aishman